Good evening, everybody. Welcome to the stream. Can I just get a double thumbs up if the audio and visual is OK? I hope that it is. Um, bit manic today. Been busy, busy, busy. Uh, went out to see. Uh, well, went out with Joe uh, a little bit earlier on to see a film. Got back and just mad manically just trying to get everything set up. Um, to that effect, we've got the randomizer is extracting to my streaming PC as we speak. Uh, we've got about 18 minutes of extraction to go. It is going to be the new version, version three, although it's not quite there. There's still a few little bits I need to finish up. Um, I've got another couple of hours work to do on it, but it's pretty much there. All bar the testing now, the proper real world testing, beta testing is all done and um, it's looking reasonably OK. So hopefully I will have a little look at that in a little while. Um, obviously, we can't do that until after the first race um, at the very soonest, because obviously I need it to extract before I can actually look at it. Um, and it's saying 40 minutes at the moment. Uh, typical Microsoft, one minute is 20 minutes. So the next minute is 40. Uh, it doesn't really know how long it's going to take. To download plus i'm streaming plus i've got the playstation running through the internet so everything is sort of fighting for um resources at the moment but it's only extracting locally it's not using the internet so hopefully it won't bump with the stream so a good evening r also known as kojak welcome to the channel my friend and the stream um, if you haven't already, please check out the description in the live stream video just for the rules that we adhere to, although I will be covering them in a few minutes after the welcome. Uh, we'll just let a few more people join us. Um, in the chat, we've already got R, oh, we've got RL9010, Ernie Ball, uh, we've got Aid, MZ Motorsport, Reese, Greg, Terry, Matt. John, good evening to you all. I hope that you are all well. Um, and in the room, we've already got 15 people. I can't believe it. It's two minutes past nine and the room is almost full. The lobby. Um, IRL9010 has grabbed a seat, as has Shumi, as has Gamer Dan, Ernie Ball and Kojak. Aid, Mad Mikey, Reese, Jack Kobe, David, myself and Malkovich are all in the room. Speedy Bees just jumped in with the Veyron and Dowie Motorsport. Uh, Unfazed is in the room and Technic is in the room. Um, so we had um, Dowie joined us uh, last night, the night before, just very, very recently. And our new racer tonight is Kojak. Uh, in the chat, Kojak is R. And when I mentioned in the chat, at the chat on the YouTube live stream, um, I'm going to get this one underway pretty quickly. We pretty much all know this track, I think. I'd like to get into it because we've got quite a lot to run through. And uh, tonight, the randomizer, I would say, has not been overly kind to us. Um, and then there was some chats which I picked up while I was out, and I don't know the full context of everything um somebody was saying maybe mitchell will let us do it at the end of the stream so i think somebody else wants to do something but i don't know what that is um uh, morgan crank a good evening my friend i hope that you are well looking to get involved as well although the last the last place has just gone at four minutes past nine uh, we are talking to uh, other streamers as well and, and people to host parallel lobbies but it is something that we are continuing to work on so this evening for those of us doing the uh, race tomorrow which is the super touring car championship that jack they De jackie daytona is uh, organizing on playwright stream we're going to be doing the uh, sanqua feature race which is eight laps on medium soft and um, uh, sorry racing soft and racing hard tires of which you need both. Then we'll be doing the sprint race at San Qua, which is a four lap on medium tires. Then we get into some craziness. And tonight, guys, is going to be a crazy night. The randomizer has thrown up Sardegna B in the Group 1 car on racing soft and racing hard with both compounds needing to be run. 
That's quite a small circuit for a GR1 car. That is going to be manic, to put it mildly. We're then off to Watkins Glen for GR2, uh, race to medium and, and no pit stops. And then I can't believe I'm saying this, but we're going from GR1 to GR2 and then into carts at um, Alsace West, I think that is. Uh, Alsace Test Course. Uh, and then we'd be finishing up theoretically with the GR3s at the Nürburgring. So uh, we're going from super quick to really slow. And well, I, for one, have done zero running. Um, normally I've done about 15, 20 minutes practice by this point. Um, I've done absolutely no practice whatsoever. So uh, I don't know how this first one is going to go. We've got five minutes Glasses are filthy. Um, so we've got five minutes of qualifying and then we've got the race. So I'm going to have five, literally just literally a lap or two just to get myself in the zone and hopefully not cause create mayhem everywhere. Um, good afternoon, Wayne Mint and Welsh boy. Good evening, good evening, good evening to you guys. Right, let's get this one underway and we'll see how we do. Hopefully everybody is all set and ready to run. Um, Twenty-two people watching at the moment. If you haven't already, please smack the like button. And let's see how we go. Hey, playwright. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, you've got your usual shout out for... For, uh, for tomorrow. Are we all set up and ready to rumble? I'm really, well, I say I was looking forward to it, but um, we shall see if I can keep it on the track face in the right direction. Uh, one thing I've got to remember is these hard tyres take forever to switch on around here. I can go pretty much a whole lap before I can really start to lean on them. Captain 420, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Right, I need to concentrate because this is my last real run at this before tomorrow. And I need to try and do well, if at all possible. I've already got somebody probably shooting me, monstering me down this, across the bridge here. Oh, sliding through there as usual. Still really haven't got the uh, the grip and the confidence in these tyres just yet. Sliding, sliding, sliding. Oh, just caught the barrier there. Kobe going through. So I've got some quick guys up ahead of me. Hopefully these tyres will have warmed up a little bit and I can start to lead on a little bit in the moment. My expectations for a good result tomorrow are dwindling every lap I do of this track at the moment. Go, on, go, 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 go past me because you're probably on softs and I'm on hards. Good 
Give me some behind me. Reese, if you're on softs, go by me, mate. Good evening, Fargo. How you doing, my friend? Yeah, my lobbies are filling up really, really quickly at the moment. I'm not sure how many other people are looking to try and get into a race and whether there's anybody out there who is willing and able to open up a second lobby. But at the moment, I could really do with about 30 or 40 places in my uh, on these races. Oh, I'm on the grass while I'm talking. Feel free, Fargo. If you do, shout it out in the uh, chat. See if there's anybody else out there that is looking to get into some decent friendly racing. Hi Tom. There's nobody behind me. Why did he get timed out? Um, caps, lots and lots and lots and lots of caps. Um, that is the reason for the timeout. <sighs> Map Mikey, do you know what? If people just want to do this all night long, I am more than happy to do feature sprint, feature sprint, sprint feature sprint and ditch the the schedule that's going um let me let me do the following um uh, bear with me a second if i start a poll Do this for me a second. Right, there's a poll that has just gone up. Um, let me know what you would like to do. Uh, that's now gone up there. Uh, we'll do this race and then I'll get into a little bit of a welcome. Hopefully the uh, randomizer might be done then and uh, we can just go from there and we'll see what the uh, what the, the, the poll is saying. Um, please keep it respectful. Uh, just a couple of little housekeeping rules, especially for the new guys in the room. Please keep it respectful. If you do bump somebody and you ruin the race, like you kick them off the track or you put them into a barrier or you spin them around, 
whatever, whatever, whatever. If you ruin somebody else's race, just please simply give the place back as soon as you can when it's safe by way of an apology and just explain what happened in the chat and apologize and we'll all be friends. Likewise, in the chat, please keep it respectful. We have got kids uh, or, or teenagers, um, people under the age of 18 uh, that race with us. So please keep it family friendly. And if you do want to get my attention, please put at PlayStation Racer at the beginning or, or somewhere within your chat comment as uh, Captain420 did just there. Uh, and it will put my name in an orange box and I'll be able to see it It'll jump out because it does go through really, really, really quickly. Um, uh, and Captain says, uh, you need another PlayStation to run two lobbies. Oh, I hadn't actually thought of me running two lobbies, but I haven't got two PlayStations, so you're going to happen. Right, here we go. Good luck, everybody. Remember, please, please keep it respectful. Above all else, have some fun. Here we go. Hi, sugar. RL90 turn up the inside of me there, so I couldn't take my usual line through there. We've got cars all over the place. God, how on earth did I get through there? Um, RL, I hope I didn't take your bonnet off, but you were all over the place as with the other car, and I had absolutely nowhere to go. And no, I am not stopping to let anybody through, was what it is. that wall again that's giving an aid a fantastic run on me I'm gonna to need to give him some room on the inside there so gonna struggle with this tomorrow I can feel it in my bones hopefully I kept the wheel in there Been hit, been hit, been hit.
Now Royce David. Oh, I just caught Aid as he was coming back on there. Sorry Technic, that was a bounce off Aid. Not a lot I could do about that. I'm going to come in at the end of this one, lap three, ditch these tyres and see if we can actually get some uh, clean air and get running. I seem to have been battling all the way through this one and that's not something I do well. I think I'm going to need the practice tonight on this. Annoying, the pole is about 50% as usual. <laughs> Why is it that all my poles are always split? Might be because a lot of us are driving. Maybe a lot of the guys have not had a chance to vote. I don't know how many votes there are in, but I suspect a lot of the lads are probably racing. Which I don't even know which one turn nine is. Not without counting them. Uh, approaching turn nine, you can get on the curb on the left more at about the 150 board. Which one's? I don't know which one's turn nine. Um, one, two, three, four. I'll have to work that one out in a minute. So that was the end of the lap three. Let's see how these tyres do.
Yeah, that's the first time I've had the opportunity to get to do that sequence of corners the way that I, I normally do them. I've just had cars all around me up until now, so just getting into some fresh air is giving me the option to uh, actually do what uh, what I normally do. One of my weaknesses is racing in traffic. Uh, Captain, there's one small issue. You're behind me. So you're calling out the numbers, but it has no relation to me, I'm afraid. It will when I play it back later on and I look at the video. Unless you're time delaying your corner somehow. For instance, um, uh, I'm just coming up to the tight right hander at the end of the long straight. Where Technic just went off. Now I'm just going to come around and I'm just going to go through the little complex with the little dip to the little dippies right there. And I've just seen you say they are, they won. Right, let me just crack on with this and not worry about chats and things. Uh, where are we? We're sitting in ninth at the moment. I'm not quite sure who else has got a pit. Oh, we're in sync. Good, okay. In that case, the lag isn't too bad tonight. That's good news. I've got uh, Matt Mikey behind me. At least it looks like one of Matt Mikey's cars with his livery. He's quick. Very quick around here. Oh no. <laughs> I got caught up behind um, our rail and forgot about the slipstream. Bother! Something tells me I'm going to be falling down the table tomorrow big time. Is what it is. Let's see what we can recover from this now.
actually when I'm not behind somebody I'm fine it's when I'm in traffic that's what I've got to learn to do now I've got to learn to race in traffic and I have a very funny feeling tomorrow is going to be mostly in traffic Roll up to the bridge on in third, okay. Was I changing down the second up through there? the wall again well done Dan Jack and Ernie Dan our first winner of the night congratulations ah mess that up big time ah, my first run is always bad at least tomorrow I'll have a good half an hour practice before the race and I'm just going to run and run and run and run and run on those hard tyres. I get the confidence when I'm on the softs, but on the hards, just all over the place. All over the place. So at 50%, 57% to continue with this all night long. Um, guys, if you haven't already, can you please hit the poll in the uh, YouTube chat just to let me know whether you'd like to continue to do this all night long. 
or whether you'd like to continue to do what the randomizer has asked us to do. Uh, I am completely okay with doing whatever. Well, we went up one place. All things considered, I'll take that. So the result, Gamer Dan in first with a 219.3. Jack Kobe in second with a 218.5. Ernie Ball in third with a 2.199. And then we had Shumi in fourth, Malkovich in fifth, David in sixth, Mtech in seventh, Aid in eighth, RL9010 in ninth, Reese in tenth, I got eleventh, Speedy B in twelfth, Unfazed thirteenth, Kojak in fourteenth, Mad Mikey in fifteenth, and Dowie Motorsport in sixteenth. It looks like the last three didn't change for the regulation regulation tires and uh, mad mikey did get the fastest lap there at 218.3 uh reese i joined you in the abysmal performance league mate <laughs> but you did slightly better than me um gamer dan was your winner jack kobe second and ernie ball third we will dive straight into the um the sprint race for this and we'll see how things go in that one. On a medium tyres, I'm a little bit more confident. Um, I've just got to got to get to grips with this car um, around here. That said, I do normally race better when I'm not working the channel, looking at the chat and stuff like that. Um, but we shall see. The... Um, the poll is looking rather interesting at the moment. Um, let me just let everybody know when we'll... Uh, I don't think I said when the qualifier would be. At 21... Um, oh, I don't really want to wait that long. I want to get into this, especially if we're doing this sort of thing. Uh... I'm going to go 41, just to give me a second, just to check a couple of bits that I need to check. Um, so at the moment, we are sitting at 55% STCC and 45% randomizer. And uh, that is with 22 votes. So at the moment, it looks like we're going to be doing this all night long. And the one reason why I'm entertaining the idea is obviously, you know, there's a lot of people in here that want to get practice for tomorrow. Um, quite a few of us. And believe me, at the moment, I think I need practice. Uh, right, have I put the medium tyres on? I can't even remember what I've changed. Yes, I have. Okay, um, is M Tech running this tomorrow? I don't think. We've got quite a bit to get through. Okay, let's um, let's go for it. Now. So if he was if he was running this, then I'd have waited. Uh, Terry West, do a longer race with more laps with two pit stops. I can't. This is the um, the schedule that we're running tomorrow. These are the two races that we're running tomorrow. So um, I'm literally mirroring what we're at. If I start doing extra stops, it's going to mess up strategies and things. Normally I would be guided by you guys and change things around. 
This one is a little bit out of my control. Oh dear, where did that come from? Don't drive the car in front, drive the track. I was watching uh, Gamer Dan through there, not, not where I want you to be going. Sometimes I can do that in third, sometimes fourth, it's annoying. My consistency is woeful around here, even when I'm concentrating. Oh, trying to roll up to the bridge in third and I've gone wide. <laughs> Need a bit more brake I think through there. I really shouldn't be changing my uh, changing things at this late stage. Just need to get through this race really picking up as many places as i can if i can finish mid tape mid, mid um midway up the finishing order i'll be pleased if i'm perfectly honest tomorrow Thank you Fargo, I appreciate that, I don't feel as if I'm doing well. If anybody is watching me tomorrow you're going to find I'm going to be very, very quiet during these proper, proper races. Um, you're going to see a completely different, uh, different side to me.
I can't go. I heard what you said about rolling up to in third, but I just feel as if I've got no control and I don't get the rotation. So I'm doing something wrong going up to the bridge. Something different to what you guys do that are rolling up there in third. It's uh, not really, not really working for me, I'm afraid. First corner, I can do a bit faster. Oh, Fargo, there's going to be places all over where I can go quicker. I'm not particularly quick around here. Um, I mean, I am a lot quicker than I was at the beginning of the week. I'm up about six, seven seconds, I think, on when I first started to look at this. Um, I don't know what, what lap time. Uh, so I've got 2.23.7, which is not great, but I was on a, a, a 2.28.2.9. Two um, so 228, 229 when I first started doing this at the beginning of the week. Quickly lost a few seconds with some help from people on the stream. And then I've lost more throughout the week. But um, I'm still woefully bad on this one. Right, let's um, let's get straight into this one and we'll see how we go. Uh, what I've got to hope tomorrow is it's a lot of people who haven't been practicing and that struggle and wind up in walls and, and grass and if i can pick up a few places that way and i need to stay out of trouble so um i'm i'm, I'm going to go back to doing the entrance to the bridge how i've been doing it before i hope we'll we'll see how we go um right here we go one two three four five we are away. I'm not sure what happened with eight there. He seemed to just go backwards. Just got into the back of on phase and needed a lift out of that one. That's let RL to get uh, underneath me. And he's got the inside now. No pit stop, pit stop strategy in this, which is straight into it. I am a little bit elbows out in this race today because this is how it's going to be tomorrow and for that I do apologise to people that are racing and going up the inside but it's what I've got to do and I've got to, well all of us that are racing have got to learn how to do that. As in those of us that are racing tomorrow. Oh, that favour on is quick. 
Thankfully, I don't think anybody's in the bay on tomorrow. Try a little bit of defending as we go down the hill. Oh, Reese, I'm sorry that somebody um, span you out. Reese, shout replay to me at the end of this one and I'll review it later on. Because I have a new penalty system that I'm working on at the moment a fresh idea that we're going to be introducing and I'm just beginning to build it into the randomizer software so I've got everything in there Okay, no worries, Rhys. As long as you're okay, that's fine. Right, where's Mr. Kobe? Oh, crikey, I haven't got to worry about Mr. Kobe. I've got Mad Mikey chasing me down now. Oh, and Jack's behind him. Oh, no. Two really quick guys around here and Gamer Dan's in the mix. I smell trouble guys. I really do smell trouble. Got one more lap after this. Only 1.7 to Kobe. Jack Kobe's behind. Oh no. I could be having to go super defensive in a minute. Come on. You watch that time just drop now. Despite me putting in purples, it's going to evaporate. Did he catch me that fast? No, oh, it's too deep. Oh, the pressure. The pressure is just insane.
The only thing in my favour is they've got to find their way around me. Gosh, three and two is not going to work. Oh, no. Oh, Mad Mikey, I'm sorry. Go, 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 go. I clobbered you. Pedal sticks. I knew three into there was going to be tough. Right, so, um, uh, I'm so not sure what to do now. We're 56 to carry on with the STCC, but we're 44 for the randomizer, which is a little bit 50-50 in my mind. Um... Hmm, I'm not sure what to do now. I am not sure what to do, if I'm perfectly honest. I do need the practice, Jack. I really do need the practice. Uh, your result on that one, Jack Kobe in first with a 219.7. Uh, Gamer Dan in second with a 219.9. Technic in third with a 223.1. I got fourth. Uh, Ernie Ball in 5th, RL9010 in 6th, Aid in 7th, Mac Malkovich in 8th, Unfazed in 9th, Chimmy 10th, Speedy B in 11th, David 12th, Kojak 13th, Dowie in 14th, and Mad Mikey and Reese were DNFs in that one. But your top three, Jack Kobe, Gamer Dan, and M Tech. Um, okay, Aid is disappearing. Uh, maybe do one more in substitute. Well, I'll tell you what, the, the random round. Well, we've got the carts. I mean, I don't really fancy the carts, if I'm perfectly honest, if I am perfectly truthful. Um, so let's let's dive in here and do one more of these at least. So we'll go back to the feature race. Um, Arrow 9010s, no carts, John Wick. It won't, um, John is 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 um, is no carts. Uh, Ernie Ball is out. Um, so uh, we we're going to substitute the carts for a start. 
Uh, and the other thing as well is, I mean, Sardegna B in GR1 is a bit mad. Um, so what I might do is I might do two of these. <laughs> yeah, I know, Jack, you did both sides of me. I had nowhere to go. But it's good. It's good because that really, that really made me have to think and work oh, it's in a situation that i'm not used to and in that moment to have the ability to process who's going where who's doing what and then think about your own where you're going is is tough um very very tough there's a lot of people uh, i think uh, we're up to 58 and 42 now, so it is going slightly in the direction of STCC. So uh, I think we're going to be sticking with this for the time being. For those of you that wanted to do the randomizer stuff, I apologize. Uh, just whilst we're doing this STCC lark, um, the my normal schedule is going a little bit out the wall, out the window. The only reason I'm a I'm a, a bit hesitant is if anybody's been out there buying cars. And now suddenly we're not running them. And that's that's annoying. That is annoying. When a host does that to you, it can be really annoying. So what I might actually do is I might do these two. We do the feature and the sprint one more time as quickly as we can. Then I'll get into the randomizer stuff that we had said we were going to do. Ignoring the carts by the sound of things. Um, and then I'm going to do what I did last night. I'll finish the stream and then we'll go into doing feature sprint, feature sprint, feature sprint for as long as I can stay awake. Um, the other thing that I have not done is the, the randomizer has finished. Um, I might actually leave the randomizer until Monday, if I'm honest. Uh, we've got quite a lot going on here at the moment. Um, so I may well leave going through the randomizer with you guys then. Um, for the moment, I am going to get this one underway. Um, let's see what we can do in this one. So I do need to let you know what's happening with the randomizer, um, purely because we've got um, some big updates to it and um, I've also building in a um, a penalty system um, where people will get penalties for certain things uh, once you hit a certain number of penalties then um, there will be one race one not one race but one lobby one evening bands Uh, Jack, what I'm going to do, to be fair to people, because some people may well have bought cars, is we'll drop into some of the random stuff. And then once we've got some of that done, I probably won't do the Nordschleife for tonight. Um, but we'll do the, the two or three races. They'll be fairly quick. And then we'll get back into this again afterwards. So a little bit like I did last night. Oh, I missed, I missed my breaking point. watching the chat I'm assuming Monday we will do the same again. We'll start off with whatever we're running for Friday 
but then we'll get into the randomizer and um, I'll probably finish up with more Friday stuff but it, it won't be like this I mean I'm doing a few extra races because we're actually doing this tomorrow night that's the only reason Oh, Jack's got a beautiful line through there. Hi, Kian, how you doing? I'm doing well, my friend. Well, I will be if I can stay with Jack and have a half decent run around this lap, and I've lost him already because I've gone too wide into there. Oh, somebody said I can go through there quicker, so I'm trying to go through there quicker, and now I'm lousing it up. I've missed my breaking point again. Oh, we've got more people rage quitting by the looks of things. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Do you know it's a pain if you crash on this bridge trying to stay out of everybody's way, it's nigh on impossible. Let's let this one through. Right, in this next one, I'm going to treat this like tomorrow so i'm going to be very 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 quiet barely looking at the chat i'm just going to be full on concentration I tried Jack Stein through there, now I've got a penalty. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna have to stick to I'm just gonna have to stick to what I do and see what happens tomorrow. It just seems to be that when I'm I'm playing around and changing stuff, I'm just causing myself more grief. Uh, and putting more pressure on myself for tomorrow and it's probably a little bit late in the day to be doing that but I did I was just watching Jack go through that last little section and that was brilliant it looked really really good into this one to see how we do so car settings tires are on hard uh, just give everybody a moment or two just to see where they are at the moment we've got 13 people in the room um, oh Greg don't worry about giving me a dent in the door 
over the bridge. Uh, I was all over the place. Uh, Jack Kobe, Game of Dan, Carlos Fandango is in, good. Uh, David is in, Shumi is in, Drac Fury is in, M Technic, RL9010, Unfazed, Speedy B, Mad Hatter, Dowie, Motorsport, and myself. Those are your runners. And um, I am. I have not set a time. I have not set a time for this one. That means I'm going to be starting right at the back. Ouch. Woucher. Yeah, Greg, I think I would, um, I'd had an accident on the bridge. I was sideways trying to get out of people's way and uh, didn't happen. Right. Three. Two, one. Do you know what, Jack? I've been thinking about pitting on that one, but I don't know if the tyres are going to go all the way. Whoa. When you've got it like this, the undercut pitting early is a good idea when you're in lots and lots of traffic like this. Got a car on the outside of me. I gave Drac a little bit too much room there. Of course, my problem now is going to be fuel. That is going to be my biggest issue now. think that's gonna work we'll see yeah me too me too But 
we'll see. Tell you what, this car, I don't want to give anything away. But something's something's changed in this car. That isn't just maybe it's the tires. the wall there just sliding a bit Missed my breaking point there. Have I pushed somebody off? Didn't see the comment.
I'll just try carrying a bit too much speed through there again. Sorry guys, I'm running a very insane strategy and I'm trying to just see if this works. I'm just trying to concentrate like crazy. So I'm not getting involved with any of the chat and stuff that's going on. I can see stuff that is going on. As soon as I start to think about that, I go wrong. Where are we? We're in seventh. gear out of there where am I five of eight Four laps to go. I've got loads of fuel. And we're in the 21s. Where are
it's losing that front tyre a little bit now. Sorry I've been quiet. That was a hard race. Boy, that was hard. Carlos Fandango, well done my friend. Well done, well done, well done. It's a tough race. Tough. Come from the back. <laughs> Do not try that strategy in the favour and I won't wait. <laughs> that was uh that was some strategy, I tell you. That really, really was. Uh your winner there, Carlos Fandango in the M4 with a 2.19.3. Uh Gamer Dan in second with a 2.19.0. Jack Kobe in third with the fastest lap of a 2.18.4. Mad Hatter in fourth. David in fifth. I managed to get six. Still some way off the pace with the 2.21.3. Uh, Jack Fury in seventh. RL90.10 in eighth. Unfazed in ninth. Speedy B in tenth. Uh, Dowie Motorsport in eleventh. And Shumi and Technic were both DNFs in that one. But your top three. Carlos Fandango, Gamer Dan and Jack Kobe. Well done to the three of you well done well done well done Ooh. um right let's just edit the event settings uh, go into the sprint race and we'll see what we can do this time who have we got in the room at the moment um
I just need a moment or two just to settle down and after that one. Ooh. Wow. Carlos, that was an awesome run. Really well done. Really, really well done. DKRL. 90. No. Yeah, Dan, I have noticed the DNFs kicking him. Um. Technics just said, beware, DKRL and Fury were punting off. Those two guys don't do that. I've raced with both those two guys for ages. I have recorded that video, that last one. Um, what I would say, Technic, if you've got an issue, pop it up in the stewards for us to have a look at tomorrow. Why is Fargo Nige, Nige said last corner Mitch with three smiley faces? What, what, what am I doing? Is, is that where he's winning it and I'm losing it? this one um i'm trying wrongly i know but i'm trying to stay out of the arguments at the moment tonight because i'm trying to get my head together for this race tomorrow um so forgive me that i am a little bit quiet and not getting involved with what's going on uh, those of you that have raced with me long enough you will know why I've just said that um, for those of you that are new around here um, the way things are going it's probably not going to be long before you see the me not the Mitchell Morgan but the me um, oh no bits I need medium tyres because um, the guy that you see on here is not the real me. Um, when did I say we'd start? 22. Right, um, because of everything that's going on at the moment, um, because I want to keep this lobby going tonight, please can we keep it respectful. If you bump somebody and you spoiled a race, please give the place back by way of an apology and just run with them. Just keep it respectful, guys. Please just keep it respectful. Uh, Ernie says kick everyone who is not in the chat uh, I'm considering it but I don't know who is and who isn't in the chat my biggest problem with that are the different names um, I could quite easily kick somebody that is in the chat because the name is different uh, um, so that's one of the reasons why I hesitate uh, see Morgan Crank is Scrang Frank in the game which I would never have known Chat Kobe, respect please. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> 
Um, and we, one of the things that I am going to be doing very, very, very soon, and I, I've said it several times, but I've been trying to get the randomizer to sort it out. Um, we are going to be awarding penalties for DNFs. In fact, I need to write that down. And um, so if you DNF enough, you're going to rank up enough penalties to get a ban, a one night ban. And incidentally, somebody said to me the other day, if there's an infringement tonight, ban them till Monday. Well, that doesn't work, because if you only race with us on a Thursday night, banning you till Monday, it does absolutely nothing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to know who is on a ban. When they appear in a race, they will get kicked that evening. And no, I did not run that car off. Uh, they'll get kicked that evening. So they will feel the pain. Admittedly, if you're on a ban, and you know you're on a ban, you could log on to your PlayStation, pop in the lobby, get kicked on a day that you weren't going to race. I can't do anything about that. But I have to say, and I'm going to say this publicly, a lot of this stuff that's going on is actually putting me off my racing this evening. And that's not what I'm here to do. If people don't want to qualify, they should just stay in a garage and join at the back of the grid. Somebody doing a shout out saying that people are blocking in the quality by going down the middle of the track. I haven't actually seen that myself. But I'm here to race guys, I'm not here to babysit and settle arguments. That's what the stewards are for. And the stewards lobby is in the Discord. If you've got a grievance, open it up in the Discord. We'll have a look. I am on the stewards panel. And as you're going to see on Monday, I am taking dirty driving and all this aggravation very, very, very seriously right now. The stewards that I've chosen are doing a fabulous job in a channel that you guys can't see publicly. I'm learning a lot and I think we're going to make a, a much better environment for all of us to race going forwards but it's just taking me a little bit of time to uh, put it all together and we're going to have a multi-level penalty system when you hit nine penalty points that will be it, it will be black and white. It won't be, oh, I happen to like Jack Kobe, so I'm gonna let him off. No, he's going down. Or it might be that I don't like Mitchell Morgan, so I'm gonna be hard on him. No, it is gonna be black and white. It will be what it is. And I will be publishing what the different penalties are and the different penalties will, will grow as things develop in the channel and as I start to learn how to race in a racing sim. Host better. Ooh, that was better. Maybe I should get a bit angry more often. Oh no, I've got a limit. So it wasn't better. <laughs> oh no. That means I'm starting at the back again.
Oh, Fargo, did we kick you out? No! I didn't realise. Um, sorry. That, that's your penalty for winning last time. <laughs> um. Hi, Jenky. Um. <laughs> Just scroll through the chat and you'll see. Just scroll through the chat and you'll see. Jack Kobe, just remember why you're doing all of this. I'm doing this for fun. I'm doing this as a hobby. I'm doing it because I enjoy it. I do it because I like to hang out with you guys of an evening and come out racing and socialise. And I'm monetized for a very specific and very exciting reason. But it's going to take me some years to get there. But I have got a massive plan for the community um if i ever get there if i ever get there um right let's just get this one underway um just guys please just keep it respectful you know the rules if you bump somebody and spoil somebody's race just just give the place back it's not hard it's such a simple rule it's so hard. And I'm not going to lie. Just recently, it's like managing a bunch of kids. Sorry, I'm getting a bit wound up. I shouldn't say that on the stream. Oh, I nearly got into the back of our there. It's me saying keep it respectful. And I nearly outbreak myself. Back out of that. Sorry, Dowie, that was my mistake. I got caught between the two of you and ran into the back of you. That was all on me. Sorry. It's not hard, just back out, let the person pass.
I'm no saint, but if I do bump somebody, I will give the place back. I'm too close to bump draft him. Yeah, that's too close. I was going to try and bump Speedy B, but too close to the corner. Oh, it's going around. Oh, Speedy, thank you. <laughs> he straightened me up. <laughs> I was a goner there. I think I might have just cut that corner. This is all a bit scrappy. Yeah. He's not a human, that's called a bug.
Oh. <laughs> I forgot to stop looking at the chat. Speedy, go, go, go. You're going to have so much more power than me. I've got damage. It's just cleaned up. Well, I think I'm, Reese, you could be right. I could well be up in front of the stewards. After that, my, my mind is not on this tonight. Um, too much going on. Too much going on. I'm going to. Um, Jack, you and I need a break from this. We are going to be heading off to some madness. Um, the next race is going to be Sardegna B, Group 1. Racing soft, racing hard. You need both the tyres. I am going to come back to this jack at the end of the stream like we did last night if you want to practice some more. Um. It just seems completely crazy this evening. So where do we get on that one? Uh, Mad Hatter first with a 219.8. Gamer Dan in second with a 219.9. David in third with a 220.1. Technic in fourth. Jack Fury in fifth. Jack Kobe in sixth. I got seventh. Speedy B eighth. RL9010 in ninth. Unfazed in tenth. Jackie Boy eleventh. Dowie Motorsport in twelfth. Syntho Labo in thirteenth. And Scran Frank in fourteenth. Your top three on that one Mad Hatter, Gamer Dan, and David. Right, okay. All right, let's um, let's get into some silliness, shall we? Complete craziness. Uh, Jack, if you want to take a break and then come back later on, feel free. Um, I will make places in the public lobby at the end of this for those of you that are racing tomorrow. Um, even if the room is full, we will make room. Uh, since which group one do I, I don't know. Uh, um, um, that's a very, very, very good question. Uh, the LM55 VGT is pretty good. You've obviously got the Tomahawk if you want it as well, which is mental. Um, I'm going to go with the LM55 VGT for this one. But it's a very, it's a tight, it's a small track. This is the randomizer, the, the, the randomizer has thrown up what I think is going to be a stupid race and if we don't get bumping on this one I'll be a monkey's I will be a monkey's uncle because this is going to be completely bonkers and I mean stupid bonkers
especially on a track that we don't run very often as you can see Good question, Jack. Whoa. I can't even park it at the side of the road without losing it. Um, yes, you need to be running both the racing hard and the racing soft tyres in this one. Um, let me just double check, double check, double check. Um, racing hard and racing soft tyres are both required. So you will need to pit for one or the other. Well, this is hard. Oh, madness. Completely madness. Completely crazy, this is. Right, I think everybody is in and ready to rumble and we need to be using, um, let me just do a reminder, racing soft and racing hard.
I tell you what, Synth has picked a good card. That McLaren's a nice car as well, the McLaren VGT. That's actually a really good shout around here. That's a good shout. I should have gone for that car. Yeah, purely because I'm quite happy to start at the back and I wanted to get some experience on the hards. Yay, yay, yay. Oh, yeah, I'm glad I did because having to break significantly earlier on the hards than the softs. And I mean significantly earlier. Lots and lots and lots. Try one of that. Yeah, we do. Mad Hatter's got a one ten point five. That's quick. Keep forgetting about that corner. I mean, Sardegna Ray mindset going down that hill.
This is a manic car on a little tight circuit. <laughs> randomizer, randomizer, randomizer. What are you doing? What are you doing? Wow, it looks like the 919 hybrid might have been the car to go with. Look at that. One, two, oh no, the 908 hybrid and then the 919 hybrid. Um, wow. Crazy or what? God, I've got such a headache right now. Just over the last half an hour. Jack Kobe, I didn't even notice it. I didn't even notice it. Oh, David likes that combo. I'm surprised people like this combo. I thought this was going to be a complete write-off. I really did. I thought it was going to be a complete nightmare. Right, let's get this one underway and let's see how we go. Good luck, everybody. Please keep it as clean and tidy as we can yeah it's um on the road layer a um gl once on on a is good it's just this is what the randomizer threw up i punched it in uh, earlier on today this is what it said to do this is what we're doing um this is one of the completely random ones it's not in the randomizer this is a completely random race and I will go through the randomizer on Monday for those of you that are new around here so you know what I'm talking about because I do appreciate a few of you out there have no clue what I'm talking about. I'm in the wars already and I haven't started yet. <laughs> Whoa! Speedy, big sideways across the track there.
don't wind up backwards. in this one and it's all over because it's so quick it's just no time to recover which was a real shame because I was sitting pretty there learning how to drive this car around here it's just something we haven't done before so it's all a bit new to all of us and you know that it takes me a few moments a few minutes a few laps to get used to a track Even with a big lash up, we got fifth. Oh, we could have podium there if I hadn't have put it into the barrier, I think. Did I lose eight seconds messing around on the barrier? Could well have done. Maybe a podium would have been a bit, bit of a stretch. Wow, what a combo. What a combo. Did you like that one, guys? Um, that was crazy, 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 crazy. Do you want that in the, do you want that in the randomizer, guys? I can put it in the randomizer if you want. Game it, Anne. Uh, good evening. Thank you very much for the good luck tomorrow. Thank you, my friend. Have a good evening. Sleep well. Or enjoy the rest of your day. <laughs> yeah, no, putting it in the randomizer was a bit of a... Um, was a little bit of a joke, I'm afraid. Right, I'm going to do... Um, we're going to head across to number 53. Three Watkins Glen. This is another quick car. I'm not sure if I've got this in the randomizer already. 53, is it in there? Yeah, it is. We're after GR2 this time. Where are we? 
Watkins Glen. Um, I need a standard one, which I think is that. The other one is um, is beefed up a bit, I think. Right, did the randomizer take whilst you guys are just sorting your cars out? Well, what tyres are we? We're on racing mediums and none. So racing medium, we do not need to pit. So... Basically, um, if I go qualifier at uh, 23, I do 23.30, just gives people a few minutes just to get used to the car around the track. Unfortunately, um, I'm not going to be doing that. Um, so basically, what, what would normally happen, guys, you would normally see this window. Um, let me just move this up. And then if I go into daily races, you'll see there's a few new buttons on here. And I need to bring up today. Uh, and then so we started off with that race. Then we had that one. Then we did that one that we've just done which no it wasn't let me um that's the one we've just done no it isn't um this is all telling me lies let me just have a little look um i have got bugs in here um what i need it's the 19th of april i've got the wrong day that's why I've got the wrong day. Uh, so what I need to do is I need to have a little button that sets this to today. That's just one of the updates I want to do. Um, so, yeah, I think we started off in that one. Then we went group four on the hards. Then we went to sub and the one we've just done. So that is your stats for this race. So you can see on the uh, screen there, for those of you that are watching, we're at Watkins Glen Long Course. Available cars that we can run are the Group 2 cars. You can only set the brake balance. We're doing five laps. We've got a tyre wear and fuel consumption of five. We are on mechanical damage heavy. That is going to need to be updated. Um, I am slowly changing the, uh, the damage and stuff in the randomizer. It's not correct actually on in the randomizer itself, although we're slowly doing it in here. So, for instance, in here, I'm going to go light now. Oh, I might just leave it as heavy. I'm going to leave it as heavy. Um, I've got to go through and get the two in sync. Still a lot of work to be done. An awful lot of work to be done. Um, no limit on PP. Racing tyres are a racing medium. No need to pit. And normally we'd be setting this up as late morning and fully random weather. Um, so I have got to go through and match the randomizer to the game. There's still quite a fair bit of work to be done. But that's the randomizer. And um, a little bit of a heads up. This is not done yet. This is where we will be looking at the steward's inquiry. If somebody does something a little bit naughty and we review it, then uh, we're capturing the date of the incident, the track, cars involved, people involved, the incident, what happened. The steward's decision, any evidence that's been supplied, the steward's notes, my notes, and any general notes about it. Uh, but there we go. That is the randomizer. Uh, let's just close out of that window. And we'll go back to that one. I'm going to head back to the race because I think we're coming up on time to actually be doing it. Um, good night, Ernie. If that's you that's disappearing. So we've lost um, quite a few people. We're down to nine races at the moment. Um, it is half eleven, so that does often happen. 
and we're literally going to be getting this running in just a moment um, just waiting for Drac to grab a car uh, Fargo great racing guys I'm off to bed have a good one good night my friend sleep well John thank you for hitting the like button we've got 33 people watching please smack the like button if you haven't already please smack the like button I'd love to get near to 50 likes on these uh, but we are going to get this one underway in just a moment I'm waiting for the clock to tick over to half past and then we will be going Morgan, you got to be very, very quick. Very quick, because we're about to go racing. Right, let's get this one done. Whew. And then I've just... Um, I'll do a vote in a minute as to whether we want to do the, the Nord Sliper. Or just straight back into the um, practicing for tomorrow. I've got no clue where to brake for this one. 400. slide get out of the way of that car I don't want to wreck his flying lap right let's see if we can settle down a little bit The answer to that is no. I think that's a penalty, therefore this won't count. squeeze on the accelerator not jump on it
<laughs> I've wasted my laps. I'm trying to get out of the way of these two guys. I'm making it even worse for myself. My lap was gone, so it was pointless to me spoiling this as well. Hmm. So it looks like the GTR Nismo is a good car around here. Look, the top three are all in the Nismo GT500. And Hatt is also in the 500, as is MTech. Uh, a synth is in the RS5. Jackie Boy is in the RCF. RL9010 has gone for the um, GT1. And I'm in the NSX concept. I'm the only one that's gone for the concept. That tells you a lot, doesn't it? I haven't got a clue what I'm doing, what car to get in, or anything. That's a lad, that's why we put it on. I like heavy damage because in the real world, if you bump your car, you can't just wait for 20 seconds for it to fix itself. It's damaged for the rest of the race. Uh, I also think it makes people race a little bit more carefully, but I got outvoted. Everybody wanted light damage. So we've gone light damage in these races. But I, I like heavy damage. If I had my way, it would all be heavy. Heavy, 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 heavy. The problem with heavy is obviously if somebody runs into the back of you and hits you, and it's not your fault, you've still got the damage to carry for the rest of the race. But in the real world, that's what happens. Anyway, that's another story. I lost the vote. It is what it is. The community won. And the host last. Was that clean or did I push somebody there? I think I may well have pushed somebody there. I'm going to... Um... Oh! I'm going to... Uh, there, I'm going to drop it on the straight. Well, what happened there? Did I catch the grass or something? Where's M-Tech? I did say earlier on that my uh, mine was not on it. When we get all the arguments in the chat, it really does. Yeah, I completely stuffed that one up. I am afraid. I'll come out of it just so that we can watch the other guys. Um, I wouldn't normally have 
quick, but I just want to come out and enjoy some of these guys running. Uh, so we've got David out in front in the monster cart being chased down by Jack Kobe. Behind him, we've got Mad Hatter. Oh, big slide from David on the exit there. The back getting really, really loose on the exit. Uh, Jack Fury is in fourth. Aro 9010 is in fifth. Jackie Boy is in sixth. Scram Fank in seventh. Syntho Lebo in eighth. Um, and yeah, I apologise to those people that I hit. I think I put a wheel, two wheels on the grass and it just swapped ends uh, going down that straight. Which is a bit stupid. Uh, so guys, stay off the grass if I was you. <laughs> Just um, yeah, as you can see, these guys up front, the lines they're taking. They look, they got a good 12 inches off the grass in a lot of these uh, areas. Getting right on the line there, David was, but all of them giving the uh, curbs and the grass a wide berth. Unfortunately, I didn't, and uh, just caught the grass and did a swapper. Uh, just on board with Jack Kobe now, chasing down David. And we've got Mad Hatter just behind. Just staying in this fan view at the moment, just enjoying these guys racing. We've basically got three races. We've got uh, these three up the front. We've then got another little uh, battle back here, although a little bit spread out. And then right at the back, we got, oh, well, we did have Synth chasing down Jackie Boy. Uh, but the race. I think is up the front here between these three guys Mad Hatter, Jack Kobe and David uh, Mad Hatter's just off the back at the moment but Jack Kobe is right in there he's right on the back of David now I think Jack Kobe can smell a place here he can smell first place can he get it done though let's go on board with uh, Jack see how he's doing we'll do the follow cam uh, Mad Hatter's not far away from this one but Jack is starting to apply the pressure. Nice first corner there using all the inside of the kerb. How brave are they through here? Jack got a slightly straighter line through there. That's giving him a little bit of a run on David plus a slipstream. He pulls out to the near side. This is going to be a bit tight through here. He's going to have to give room. Oh no, David backed out of that one. Jack Kobe had none of that. That was my corner. I'm going for it, he said. And David had to concede the corner. Uh, that could easily have been a big old wreck. Uh, but David has done the right thing. Backed out. He'll now settle down, I have no doubt. And he'll be on the back of Drac Fury before we know it. Although the laps are counting down. Short races tonight. Very short races. Uh, Drac Fury is just off the back a little bit at the moment. But uh, this is the race. Uh, the rest are all a bit spread out. So we're going to come around in a moment. We've got a couple of corners after this one and we'll be on to the start finish straight. The big question is how brave is David through these last few corners? Can he close up on Jack at all? Somebody said to me the other day, oh, that it's really interesting. When you get out in front, all you've got to do is run your line. When you're behind, even just by a second or so, you've got to overdrive yourself to catch. Because theoretically, and I know this isn't necessarily true, the guy out front is driving the perfect race. Great braking points, turning points, running his own line. The guy behind has got to drive even quicker than the perfect lap to catch him and that did resonate with me I mean unless you can get in slipstream and get the benefit of that if like um, poor old David here were you a couple of seconds off Ooh, excuse me um, it's very difficult to catch especially when guys are at this level where's Jack he's uh, still seven seconds eight seconds behind so these two really pulling away right now. Let's just go and watch Jack Kobe as he's going to uh, come up to this last little sequence. We've got a uh, tight right into a tight left, into a medium left, 
to another medium right and then we get the uh, start finish straight so you can see there now he's got uh, 2.8 seconds over David he's uh, theoretically got this in the bag but he gets it loose on the exit of that corner David a lot tidier uh, but Jack has got masses of time in hand for this one he comes across to take first place we'll drop back just catch David coming across the line also and then some nine seconds down the road we've got Drac Fury in the Tom and Jerry car coming across the line to take third we're the flurry and oh he stopped just before the line RL 9010 almost got him on the line in that GT1 Scan Frank just a little bit behind Jackie Boy coming across the line now as well to take sixth and Synth Labo is a little way back um, I suspect that this is a car that he's not used to running on a track that he's not used to running so um, all credit to you for finishing my friend you did better than I did but I did just want to jump in and just enjoy these uh, cars just for the moment Oh, well, that's, uh, that's an interesting thought, actually. Just put a note up there. Please don't spin at the finishing line. It makes it yellow for our fellow racers. Yeah, if you've got a hard-fought race that you're going to the line, you're actually going to cause a problem. So what you need to do is get way past the line before we do that. Um, yeah, good shout, RL. That, that needs to go out in the Discord as well, I think. It's um, it's nice to see the flurry on the line, but I'd never thought about that before. That does actually really mess people up. Um, right, guys, do we fancy doing the Nürburgring or do you want to get back into um, the other stuff? The uh, race for tomorrow. Nords, Nords, yeah, we've got a few Nords. Greg's STCC, right. It's relatively quick. Uh, I'm going to take it down one. We're just going to do one lap of the Nords tonight. Just one lap. Uh, we're in GR3 cars. Jack, it's just, it's a, it's a quick one. It's a 10 minute Nords. Go and grab a cup of coffee or a drink. And then we'll get back into tomorrow's races. Because um, I, I don't want to be too... I don't want to be too late tonight, if I'm perfectly honest. So I've, I've knocked it back down. There you go. It's going to have a protein shake. And then we'll get into a couple of races. I'm going to hope to do the feature and sprint race um, at the end of this. Synth, one day I want you to pick up all a car each for a massive equitable reset. Okay. Uh, Greg's going to go make a brew. Um, right, let's um, let's put the racing softs on. Last night I went out on the racing hards. Um, tell you the other thing I'm going to do just for the moment. Uh, don't normally for this one. Um, I'm going to put the boost on strong. So if anybody does crash out, they can catch up with us. That's, that's a good idea, Synth, but I wouldn't know how to bounce it out properly. That'd be a really hard thing to do. Right. 
Who have we got running in this one? I'm just going to give it a couple of minutes to see. Um, I think Jack is off having a protein shake. Um, Greg is out for the moment. I think Greg, you're you're Dowie Motorsport, aren't you? Uh, I don't know what MTech's doing. BOP off? No, I don't want to take BOP off. That would be that would be a nightmare. Um. Right, let's just get this one going. I'm still working on the Cannibal Run game as well. Um, haven't quite got that ironed out in my head yet. Um. But we'll see. Uh, ooh, uh, yeah. Right, there we go, guys. Let's see how things go. Whoa. Let's see if I can get to the end without crashing. I'm going to take it slower tonight. Who did I just take him with me? Was that RL? Oh, mate, I'm sorry. But I am now about to race with probably one of the best guys on the ring. I've done nothing but crash tonight, it's been terrible. I hate GR3 cars. I'm only just getting to grips with the GR4s. GR3s bite me every time I come out in them.
told you RL90 quick. Good night. Oh, yeah, yeah. Too deep into there. He's very, very quick around here. Around the Nord Cypher. I was going to try and stay with him and bump draft him down the straight to give him a boost, but huh, that's not going to happen now. I've been doing too much GR4 racing where I'm stomping on the accelerator pedal and for the uh, GR3s you need to be so much more gentle on the application of the throttle ah, I'm just forgetting all of that tonight Just wait for um, who's at the back there. Go on, scan. Let's go. Oh, <laughs> on the curb again and around. I tell you I hate the off -rees. Hi RL250, how are you doing? I've really got to learn the Nürburgring, I really must. I'm getting there slowly but still not enough. Captain 420 just got carved up at Dragon Garden again. That will be in the dailies. That's a technical term. That's that's a technical term. Whoa, don't like that. <laughs> oh, well, well, well. One day, one day I'm going to have a decent race on the Nürburgring. Jackie Boy won that one with a seven. Oh, didn't quite get under the seven minute, but a seven zero zero point seven. Um, Technic in second with a 704.4. Mad Hatter in third with a 7074. Uh, Drak Fury in fourth. David in fifth. RL9010 in sixth. Syntho Labo in seventh. Scan Frank in eighth. And I was a nice. Your top three Jackie Boy, M Technic, and Mad Hatter. And somebody is saying that we should run the replay. Where, whereabouts track let me just come out of this we're gonna have a look at this very very quickly and then we're gonna dive into the um the dailies again i'm probably gonna not the dailies the the race for tomorrow but i'll probably set it up as a a public 
lobby so we can get some practice um bumping and rubbing other people because it's going to be a bit hectic like it may well be tomorrow uh second half of the race okay let me just uh wait till it finds the network and then we'll give that a go and and then we'll get into the next one okay so come out of there right out of there but no don't go there Oh, looks like I've got some more weekly challenges to do too. Uh, my items, replays, that one, that one. So we need the second half of this. Who am I on board with? Drac? This was RL and me. So I was, that was RL going in the war. I thought, yes, I'm actually going to get to race against the king. And then we had to go between the two, which was crazy. Then I had RL and Drac Fury behind me. And I'm thinking, oh no, the pressure. I got it wrong. <laughs> I took RL out big time there. I mean, crikey. He had nowhere to go. The poor sausage. Look, <laughs> absolutely nowhere to go. Oh, RL, I'm so sorry. Oh, I am so sorry. That was the reason why I waited for you because you got hung up on the on the uh, the alcove there. So I just waited, and then we ran together. Oh dear. Oh, crazy. If you're anywhere near me on the Nürburgring, just get out of the way. Just get out of the way. Oh, it's Drac Fury's off on the grass, big time. He's now going to be in the gravel. There he goes. Mr. Fury. We got uh, fudge and flake and mini eggs all over the place. We're up with uh, Drac on Synth, and we got a little battle going on up here. Oh, Synth gets it wrong and into the barrier. <laughs> then he comes across and catches uh, Drac and goes around. So Drac is now chasing down Mtech. I don't quite worry what we're looking for in this one.
Uh, we're just watching a replay of the Nord Slow for Jack and then we're going to get going. So we will be going in a, in a couple of minutes. So, um, quite the livery on that car. So I'm assuming at some point MTEC gets in front, does he? Oh, that's a nice move. track with a slip slipstream there it's a great place to get a slipstream it really is just there mad hat is right in there too got a look at this we've got four way here m tech is way off so I've, I've, whoa david and jackie boy getting into each other a bit and mad hat are getting in there and track fury and oh it's all a bit rough and tumble into the end here oh big old bump david and drag in hard that was gonna oh that was gonna look pretty tasty at the end um i think drag has taken our own 90 10 off as well oh boy do you know what occasionally we can drive obviously not right now but there we go um well um i didn't see any brake checking personally uh, but anyway, enough of that, enough of that, enough of that, enough of that. Let's um, get out of here and um, we will open up another lobby. And we're just going to do a little bit of the races that we have been doing. Um, so if I go um, create a new room, I'm going to load. I want the feature race and i'm going public this time so guys we're going public and um yeah we'll just see how things go Jack, you can invite some friends so long as they're not quick, my friend. <laughs> we got enough quick people around here. <laughs> um, right. And I am going to be starting to qualify at bang on time. I'm not messing around now. We're just going to get straight into it. Um, so doing six minutes and then we'll be going Jack McCall good night thank you for dropping in guys if you haven't already please smack the like button on your way out it would really 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 help me Where are we? Right, we are now into a um, public room, guys. So just bear in mind that this is now going to be elbows out. Um, it is not going to be the friendly environment that we are somewhat used to. So please just keep that in mind whilst you're racing. Um, just checking for any friend requests. Oh, Rimac, thank you for the five gifted, my friend. Thank you so much and a good morning or good afternoon. I'm not quite sure what the time is where you are. Um, but thank you, thank you, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. 
Uh, we've got 35 watching at the moment and we are sitting on 31 likes. So there is, I could do with just a few more likes if you wouldn't mind, guys. Uh, but uh, Rimac, thank you so much. Guys, throw up some beers for Rimac, please. I'm going to try and do the same. If I had some... I had some wagon wheels I'd throw them up too but I don't I don't why is that Rimac not working oh there we go and then I should have some beers there we go just for you my friend um, how do I get out of there now I like that. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Rimac. Really appreciate it. Who got those? Baz got one. Uh, Fargo Noise has got one. Dylan, Ashley, and High Octane. Well done to you all. Oh, Rimac, I'm not going to forget the wagon wheels, mate. That was uh, that was a moment. That was. Actually, it was um, Rimac, who's just gifted it just a moment ago. Uh, Rimac has just joined us. Uh, I didn't actually see that he was in, in the room. Uh, but thank you for that, Rimac. You're an absolute legend. Thank you so much. And uh, Captain and Jenky, thank you for throwing up the beers. Right, where are we? I said we would start this. I can't remember when I said we'll start it now. 15. OK, we've got three minutes before we go. Three, three minutes, three minutes. Um, for those of you that don't know what we're talking about, um, just while we're doing this. A few weeks ago, I did a charity stream. 28 hours we did. I was going to do 27. But we actually did an extra hour encore. We did 28 hour live stream without stopping well there was one or two little pauses but not very many i think i took two maybe three breaks in the whole of the time and uh rimac was was a big contributor to that and i can't thank you enough for what you did i will never forget uh what you did for us on that stream um but i was eating wagon wheels and he's in the states and um said he liked wagon wheels and miss them so i was going to send him some over uh, but then one of his relatives i think in canada contacted him and said oh we've got wagon wheels in canada so they sent some over um which got me out of sending them so that's where the wagon wheel story comes from rl9010 i still don't know what wagon wheels are you've missed you've missed the best chocolate bar in the world they're like marshmallow in a biscuit with chocolate on the outside they're about half the size of what they used to be when i was little but now you said that i'm gonna have to get a packet of wagon wheels when i go shopping on saturday and i'm gonna have to put them in my room and the next time you're on i want you to go mitchell morgan wagon wheels and i'll show you a proper British wagon wheel. Uh, they're one of the... Well, unless you've had a... You've never lived until you've had a wagon wheel. Uh, Greg says, um, do you do races for like Civic Cup and other cars like Cap Bop or any other races like that? Got me first car, bought GT7. I started doing my own liveries and would like to use on here. Um... We do all sorts of different cars and on a Friday we normally pick a car to run. So um, the Civic is a, it depends which one you've got. Which, which Civic are we talking about? Uh, it is quarter past. Um, Greg, if you're in Discord or, or come and join us in Discord if you're not already, strike up a conversation with me and we'll do a... Um, We'll do an evening in the Civic. 
Uh, we'll, we'll get something set up. We will get something set up, my friend. Right, as before, yes, I know I am qualifying on the wrong tyres. I really ought to put my, um, my data on my phone so I could see what the tyre's doing, the telemetry. Too deep. What's up, Drac? Oh, they're posh s'mores. What's a s'more? I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, they're covered, fully covered in chocolate. And they're absolutely gorgeous. Melt marshmallows. Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what you mean. Rimac saw me in Sparks Theories room the other day. I was um, I was in a few rooms the other day. I didn't recall being in Sparks though, so, but I was just I was just hopping around rooms. Something I want to do more of when I've got the time. Milk chocolate on wagon wheels. They also do a fancy one that has um, like jam in the middle, like strawberry or raspberry jam. I don't go for that one. I like the original. Oh, 
again. Jack Kobe, you are an alien around here, my friend. Oh, Matt Mikey's just jumped you. Matt Mikey's the alien. A 217? A 217? What the? Tell you what I must do. I've got to take the uh, overrun down on this to probably 60 seconds because it's way too long. Captain, that will be softs. That will be softs. Yeah, the four-wheel drive cars, they are struggling in this championship. Um, I think the, the Tensor's four-wheel drive, the Mitsubishi, the Subaru, there's a few four-wheel drives. They eat the tyres. Eat the tyres completely. But nevertheless, uh, that little 650S is darned quick around here. Mikey, are you running that 650S tomorrow? Are you in the race tomorrow? Oh, they did some orange ones for Halloween. I missed those. No way. I should have. Oh, I'd love to got that. And Captain says you got a 219 in an out lap earlier on here. Ooh, quite oh, 219. It just shows how inconsistent I am, <laughs> I'm afraid. Right, let's get straight into this one. Um, look at that, 217.7. Where did that come from? Matt Mikey says, no, not in. You're in. You're in the race. Oh, we got a bug. It says I've got an initializing issue. Is that because blue R30 is sitting there not doing anything? What do you mean it's not? All right. Hopefully you'll be able to get in on the next one. Normally it comes up with all the little lines on it if you can't get in, but there we go. Okay, here we go, guys. Let's uh, remember, um, I'm not sure if we got non-friends in here, so it could get a bit elbows out.
it's me against thugs again this is a rerun of yesterday That's useful to know. So just turn the uh, saturation down. Okay, that's a good tip. I did know about turning the um, turning the what's it down um, when it's or turning it up when it's too dark you can't see but I didn't know about that I'll have a look at that right where are we we're in eighth at the moment to look at that two boys in brings me up to fifth
Thank you, Romac. There's a lot of pressure on me at the moment. I don't know if you know, but I'm doing this uh, Super Touring Car Championship on a Friday night, and we're on. We've done round one and two, and I finished up top of the table. Don't ask me how. Then we did round three and four last week, and I was amazed afterwards to learn from the guys that I was still top of the table. Um, so lots of pressure but there's some really fast guys that have joined so I can't see it's going to stay that way but yeah to be top of the table after four rounds is just crazy so ideally what I'd love to do tomorrow is just be able to go maybe mid table you know if I can finish fifth or sixth I'll be happy very happy. Is Jack pitted yet? I got that line wrong. Yeah, I, I got it wrong that time, Captain. gorgeous when you get that right I've just realized the secret to Jack Kobe's success I just worked it out
Come on, stop being silly, make sure we concentrate. What's that, Jack Kobe's success? Well, it's quite simple, really. Um, he hates the glare of the cars that are in front of him, so he gets in front of them so he doesn't get bothered by the glare. Simples. Then the rest of us have to put up the glare and it's off-putting. Simples. David's giving me a lesson in defensive driving and I'll put it on the gravel and it's going to let him by. No, and it's going to go right round. Oh, pedal sticks. Mm. That is what you call an intimidation pass. Remac, I think we need to put water and sand in his petrol tank and he'll probably still win. <laughs> it's just an unbelievable around here. It's, I've sat and watched his videos and he's just absolutely amazing. I know, I've seen him in second. It's my mate Thugs. Because I've just binned it. I've gifted it to him again. Although part of what I'm doing tonight is I'm, I'm experimenting, I'm pushing the boundaries and you know, like any racing driver would say, if you don't spin, you're not pushing the boundaries. So unfortunately that was what happened there. I think I just pushed a bit too hard with uh, David behind me, I think. Although Thugs is now down at fourth. So was that commentator's curse or I'm not quite sure what happened there. I'm sure it was Thugs was in second. <laughs> oh Jenky. Wicked. I said the other night I was gonna buy him a, a pedal bike. Bicycle. But he'd still win. So I got a refund on my money, so I thought, what's the point? That was better. 
just pushed it a bit too much last time. approach to bend 1.4 you want to try getting on the curb left does that help Jack's finally got a two point a 2.17 wow I'll tell you what I'm loving watching Mad Mikey and Kobe around here I really am Good night, Terry. Thank you for being with us for so long. Um, if you haven't already, please smack the like button on the way out. I'll really make my day. Right, I think we've got a sprint race to do next, haven't we? Mm. 37 likes. Still struggle to get up to uh, 50. But there we go. Oh, Mad Mikey's pad died. Oh, the, the PS5 crashed. Oh, no. Oh, I've got a six star roulette ticket. Whoop, whoop. Um, don't know. I think Mad Hatter possibly got late, disappeared. Not quite sure. Uh, we get a lot of people go disappear between 11 and 12, if I'm honest. Lots and lots and lots of people disappear then. Rimac, thank you. Thank you for the good luck tomorrow. Um, oh, I'd like to stay at the top, but whether I will or not, I really don't know. It's a big ask, uh, especially given the competition that we've got. Um, there's some really quick guys that have joined. Uh, I've had a lot of luck up to this point. Um, right, let's um, go qualifier at um, 0050. And a couple of notices there. Um, David says, bad luck. Um, M Tech says, was too kind on your mess up. Yeah. Um, it happens. Well, that didn't work, did it? I'm not a time traveller. Try that again. There we go. I wish I was a time traveller. If I could be back to midnight, I'd be well happy. Um, am I using the setup? I think so. Um, let me get this. Um, yeah, medium tyres for this one. Well, it's you won't get in unless you've got medium tyres, but um, racing medium tires uh only um right i did actually think that last week um 
there's some there's some really quick boys that are in this now. It's a shame, in some respects, it's a shame that we didn't have Jack and um, a few of the others from the from the very 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 beginning, from the very beginning. Um, And I feel sorry for um, Jack in some respects because he was racing for ages with me um, in the Sylvia, but for probably a week or more, just practicing, practicing, practicing. Got some fabulous times in. And then he managed to get a place on the STCC, but unfortunately it's in the Master Atenza. So um, I'd like to say he's had to learn to drive that car and learn how to race that car around here. But no, he just jumped in it and bang, fastest laps everywhere. Um, so, uh, yeah, it's interesting. But um, unfortunately, not the car that he wants to be in. Oh, come on, gear jabber. I'm going to get this one underway, I think. I know it will cause him some grief but how long does it take to grab a car it's only a gl4 please hurry up yeah the setups are good i'm just gonna go i don't know what he's doing but we're gonna go um Yeah, Drac, hopefully we'll be doing light comms. Map Mikey, good drivers can be in any car and be quick. You always find your own level. And that's why I can jump in one car and I'm quick and I can jump in another car and I'm pants. Because <laughs> I'm not quick. I admire people that can jump in a car and just drive anything. Sign of a real racer in my mind. Ooh. What tired this is setting. This is going to have to be the last one for me, guys, I'm afraid. Now you can see what people were saying about that glare coming off the back of the cars. Earth does Jack go through there so quick? Doesn't look like it upsets his car at all. And then I get the ball a whack on the way through for good measure.
I can still see him. It's a tiny minuscule speck in the distance, but I can still see him. A bit too deep there. in the gravel. Only seventh, two and a half seconds off. Mm. Yeah, Jenky, I just wanna, I wanna, just need a break for a minute. Um, I am chasing down Jack there. I was giving it everything and I am completely shattered. Completely shattered. I'm also getting extremely tired. So I just decided to drop out of that for the moment. Oh, right. Eight of us in this one. Myself. Synth, Scran, Technic, Gary Motorsport, Thugs, David, Jack Kobe. And for some reason, I am seven seconds off the pace. Did I get a penalty in that last one? I'm way off the pace. Crazy off the pace. I hit the gravel deal. Is that what put me out on my hot lap? Okay. That explains it. Mm. Oh. oh, excuse me. Right, can't break on. Four, five, and we are go. Look, Jack was last, I think. Now, he's already in third place. How is that possible? How is that even possible?
taking loads of time out of me. Look at this. Got into the back of him. Sorry, Jack. Oh. I'm just trying so hard and making so many mistakes now. I've just not making excuses, but I've just got too tired now. Rear screen and well, we have windscreens. Do you have um, windshields? That's the difference. Like um, bumper and fender, trunk and boot, bonnet and hood. Why everything has to be so different? I don't understand. like we have manual and automatic you have stick shift and don't get me started on the differences between Z and Z I had a major debate with my niece on that. Is it a Z or is it a Z? And if it's a Z, it's a zebra. If it's a Z, it's a zebra. So, in the States, why is a zebra a zebra 
And why isn't a zoo a zoo? Leave that one hanging in the air. I think that's a penalty to cut that. Yeah, good and proper. Oh, I don't believe it. I'm chasing thugs again. What is it with me and thugs this week? I need a turbo boost button. Pushing a bit too hard to try and catch him. Ah, well done, thugs. Jack Kobe and David. Mm. Nah, not my best night. Not my best night. Uh, but the good thing is, if you have a rubbish night, you follow it up with a good night. So, ooh, maybe. Maybe, 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 maybe. We'll see how tomorrow goes. We will see. Um, at least we've done a lot of prep. I'm certainly a lot quicker than I was um, at the beginning of the week. I feel a bit more confident than I did earlier on. And, um, okay. So those laps are as good as Jack Kobe can get. I'll definitely do that. We'll have a little look and see. I've learned a few things from following you today. Um, albeit I wasn't able to follow you for very long, but there's a few bits and pieces that uh, I've been managing to um, pick up, which is good. And for that, I thank you. Um, but for the moment, I'm, I'm deadbeat. Um, I'm done. <laughs> Completely cream crackered completely and utterly cream crackered um thank you to everybody that has raced with me this evening and it's been really good uh, the lovely races were a little bit interesting looking at the chat things got a bit um a bit strange um we did do the races with the exception of the cart one and uh the completely random one was very very random um but otherwise some pretty good racing this evening and i really enjoyed the last little bit Finished up a lot later than wanted to, bearing in mind we got a big race tomorrow. Um, should really have called it a night at 12 o'clock, but we didn't. But don't tell anybody. 
I'm going to be back on um, the practice starts at half past seven tomorrow. The race starts at eight. We'll be racing the STCC until it finishes. And then we'll be jumping into the lobbies for the Subaru and uh, Mitsubishi stuff. So hopefully you'll be able to join me then. If you haven't already, please smack the like button on the way out. If you're new around here, please hit the subscribe button. And if you are a current member and subscriber, thank you so much for continuing to support me. I get overwhelmed by the whole thing. In the meantime, I am going to call it a day. I will see you again tomorrow. Take care. Bye.